Welcome. Welcome. speaker's called a Bob. It's not. Where is he? It's not him. Up here, speaker's called a Bob. I have never seen anyone. Bob, pick up Bob. Anyone. <laughs> He's coming up here now. He definitely deserves a shout out. Go on, you want to see Christian, a <laughs> <how> strong <laughs> Christian, argue Christian's points against Islamic radicals in Speaker's Corner, you have to follow this next man. Big up, Bob. So for those he of you who are watching, Bob has been fire. missing for a few weeks and he turns up today with Tommy Robinson and I hope oh. tomorrow he'll be back. Let's listen to Bob. Christ is King. There is an authority higher for us than the Parliament. There is an authority greater than us, than the Liberal media. And that is our Lord Jesus Christ. And we won't surrender our heritage, our culture, or our religion to those that seek to make us second-class citizens as dimmies in our own land. Thousands of years ago, Christians fought to defend one another against oppression and persecution. And right now, our brothers and sisters in Egypt, in Armenia, in Lebanon, in Syria, in Indonesia, in Malaysia, in Pakistan, are all suffering under the yoke of Sharia law. We must not allow Sharia law in the United Kingdom. We must stand with our brothers and sisters around the world in the name of Christ, because Christ unites black and white, white and Asian, Asian and American. He unites us under a single banner, the banner of the cross. And so, I say, and I want you to join with me in saying that it isn't Parliament that is king, or Charles that is king, but Christ who is king. Christ is king! 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 And not that I am worthy of being followed, but if you want to watch some interesting debates, you can find my channel on Bob of Speaker's Corner on YouTube. But I'm really not worthy to share a stage with this man, who I want to give a personal thanks to. Because in the north of England, as all of you well know, thousands of children were being raped, and no one was willing to talk about it until this man forced all of them to talk about it. And so I am personally grateful for what he did. And that's why I'm willing to share a stage with him.